Wait, it's all Premiere Pro? <laughs> Always has been. What it, fellas? Welcome back to the most hype, basic, bonus tutorials on YouTube featuring your supreme leader, Mortimer. So before the video starts, I would just like to say, welcome to the channel. This is your new home now. Subscribe to pay your rent. It's free. Anyway, so what are we doing today, Morph? I'm glad you asked, fellow citizen. Today we're going to be doing a more advanced Premiere Pro tutorial for you absolute units out there. Just a heads up, if you're new to editing, you might want to check out these videos first. The links are in the description. Anyway, today we're going to have... <laughs> anyway, today we're going to learn how to do some of the following. Oh boy, jeez! Give it an ass, boy. <laughs> Have you heard of Raid Shadow Legends? Be gone! Don't Stupid bitch! No, beat me! I never loved you! Alright, lads! For Scotland! Scotland! Where's the Haggis? I'm sorry, friend, I thought you were 18. That was my wife, goddammit! This looks fucking menacing. <laughs> Alright, step uno. So to edit our footage, we're going to need to get our footage. Who would have guessed? So open up your recording software. For this, I'm using OBS Studio. Link to download in the description. And then smash that record button. It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? what? It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? It's Friday then, everyone's day. out saying Friday, Sunday, do 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 I've got fucking, I've got that. I just killed him with a smoke grenade! Oh, hobby! Now that we have our footage, we need to import it into Premiere Pro. To do this, either drag it onto the timeline area here, or click on the file and then import in the top left. If you've done this method, the footage should appear here under the project section. Now just simply drag it into the timeline. Now that we have our footage, we're going to need to cut it down to the parts we're going to use in the video. To cut the video, press C and click on the area you'd like to cut. Then to return it to normal, click V and your regular cursor should appear. Just a quick tip, press L on your keyboard while watching the footage to speed it up so that you're not watching your footage for f Days. Also, keep an eye out for audio peaks in the timeline, because this could indicate when someone rages or gets scared. What the heck's going on? <laughs> Orky dorky. Now that you have your footage, we're going to need to put some text on the ting. To do this, press Ctrl T. Good job. Next, go to the editing tab on the top, if you're not already there, and customize your text to how you want it. I recommend using a bold non-serif font for your text and a dark colored stroke. This will help your text stand out more in front of the gameplay. Next, we're going to animate our text so that it pops out like this. <laughs> to do this, first center your text by clicking this button. Then scroll down to the transform section and set the scale to around 80 and click the stopwatch. After this, you want to skip forward a couple of frames and increase the size to around 120 and then go forward a few more frames and change the size to 100. The outcome should look like this. Nice. Alright, our text is looking pretty dang so far, however for the first clip I want to move our text around a bit and change the position. To do this, click on the position section under video effects in the top left and change the position, scale and rotation of the text to how you want it. Next we're going to add a shake preset to our text when someone is shouting or screaming. I've covered how to download the shake preset in the last tutorial if you guys are wondering how to get the effect. For those of you who have got the preset downloaded, simply drag the preset onto the text and then you are golden. Easy. Now that you have your caption, just align it up to the audio and then copy and paste it and change the text to cover the next captions, if that makes sense. It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? what? It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? It's Friday then, everyone's day. out saying I've got fucking, I've got that. I just killed him with a smoke grenade! Oh, hobby! Oh, 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 oh. What the heck's going on? <laughs> Next, we're going to cover zooms and motions. So, to zoom our video, all we need to do is click our stopwatch, move forward a couple of frames, and increase the scale. The video should then look like this. 
It's Friday then! It's Saturday, Sunday, what? what? To make our zooms look cleaner, however, cut the clip at the start of the zoom and at the end, and then add a camera blur to the clip by searching it under effects in the bottom left. Then set the blur percent to about 5 and it should look like this. It's Friday then! It's Saturday, Sunday, what? what? We can also add our shake preset to the clip as well, so if someone is screaming or something is bass boosted, it makes it more funny. Well, that's my opinion anyway. Alright, now I know a lot of you requested to cover motion for our text, so we're skidding. Text can be mapped to a character in the clip, so that the audience can have an easier time knowing who is talking. It also looks cool. To map the text, click the stopwatch under position in the top left and move it to the area you want it. Then move forward a couple of frames using the arrow keys and readjust the text. It can be lengthy to do this, and I find it is the longest part of editing videos, but it's well worth it in the end. It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? what? It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? It's Friday then, everyone's out saying I've got fucking, I've got that. I just killed him with a smoke grenade! Oh, hobby! What the heck's going on? Alright, now we're going to edit the sound in our clips, so let's start with the sound effects. To get the sound effects, simply open up YouTube and type in the sound effect that you're looking for. Then, copy the link to the video and paste it onto an MP3 converter. Or you could use what I use and get 4K video downloaded. We also have a section in our Discord where peeps post the sound effects and music that they have used in their videos. Link to the Discord is in the description. Once you have the sound effect, drag it into Premiere and place it where you'd like it to go. Also, if the effect is too loud or quiet, you can right click the effect and go to Audio Gain and then reduce or increase the volume. Now you have to be careful when using music in your videos, as a lot of songs nowadays can get your video copyrighted. An easy solution to this is by getting a membership of a music library website. The one I use is for Melody. Melody has hundreds of different songs ranging from a variety of different genres, so you can always find the song you're looking for. Link is also in the description. Now that you've added your music and your sound effects, let's see the final results. It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? what? It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? It's Friday Everyone's then, it's Friday, Sunday, do 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 I just killed him with a smoke grenade! Oh, hobby! Oh, oh, oh. What the heck's going on? Well, I hope you enjoyed and learned something from that failure of a video. If you need any help or are looking for any other tips in editing, feel free to check my other tutorials and join the Discord server. I'll also be recording more dank gaming highlights, so if you're interested, feel free to subscribe to the channel. Anyway, without further ado, later nerds! Scotland! Where's the Haggis?